If you want to use your own certificates for write, but the file is in a PFX format, you first need to convert them into two PEM files. If you don't already have the PFX file, you can export it from the Microsoft Management Console or you can get it from your IT department. Just make sure that you have a trusted certificate for your write server. The certificate has to point to the fully qualified domain name or it can be a wildcard certificate. It can't be self-signed. If you have the PFX file, you then also need a conversion tool. There are many different ones, but I am going to use the one on this side. I only have to download the files and install it quickly. When the installation is complete, you have to copy the PFX certificate into the bin subfolder of the OpenSSL program folder and start the OpenSSL.exe as an administrator. You need to extract two files. One of them with the name server.pem is your public key and the other one named server underscore key.pem is your private key. To transform the public key, type this into the console and hit enter. You might get asked to enter the password. And for the private key, enter this. Now go back to the bin folder. There you should find the two PEM files. You need to copy them into the certificate folder. The final step you need to do is to restart the Windows service.